What is thatch? Do you have thatch? Do you de-thatch? Or are you wasting your time dealing with thatch and de-thatching? We're gonna look at all those questions coming up. Stay tuned. What is thatch? Thatch is just a buildup of dead grass, dead roots in some cases, and it's an accumulation that happens on the soil surface that can prevent the grass from coming through properly. It can prevent air and water from properly infiltrating to feed your grass. I like a saying by a guy called Sepp Holzer. He says, if you don't want a pig to do the job, then you inherit the job of the pig. <laughs> you think, what, a pig? Yeah, if you don't want microorganisms to do the job of breaking down thatch, then you're inheriting the job of those microorganisms. You are basically taking away the work of these microorganisms because when you think of it, what is thatch? It's just food for the life in the soil. They need to eat something. And thatch is really carbon. Carbon is the fuel for the microorganisms, the life in the soil. Hey, we eat carbon. You think, no, yeah, what do you think flour, sugar, fats are? It's just carbon in different forms. But microorganisms are no different. They need carbon to live, and that's their fuel to eat. Do you really want to spend your time and money dethatching, power raking, raking with a rake? Well, what are you going to do? Think of it. If you've done it before, you rake all of this material out, and then what do you do with this? Some of you may be saying, oh, I'm going to compost it. That's great. But then what happens? You've basically made openings between the grass in some cases, especially if you have quite a bit of thatch buildup. You make openings. What do you think will happen? Do you think there's a plant that will take advantage of an opening in your lawn? Eh, let's say there's some that certainly are good at it. Think of dandelions. Go see my dandelion videos. But they will take advantage of openings. If you create an opening, they will come. You need to look at thatch and a buildup of thatch as an indicator. What? You say, what? An indicator? Like, is it indicating something? Yes, it is. It's indicating that the life of your soil is just not cranking at the level it needs to be. Go look at your lawn. Look closely. You will probably find areas where there's so little thatch. That's what you want all of your lawn to be. If there's so little thatch, it's probably an indicator that in that area, your soil life is very healthy. It's balanced how much thatch is accumulating and how much thatch is being eaten. And that's the ultimate where it can't build up because your soil life is so healthy that it's eating it at the rate it's being given. That's what you want to arrive at. Maybe you've been using pesticides, mm, herbicides on dandelions. Well, they're meant to kill. So they don't just kill the plant. They kill the life of your soil. And if you fertilize with synthetic, you know, 10, 10, 10, 20, 20, 20, and all those different combinations, you are basically saying, hey, it's okay. I've got this. I'm doing it. You don't need to be there. And that's kind of what happens. Not just that their role is suppressed, but by putting synthetic fertilizers, you are suppressing the life of the soil. If you look closely at your lawn, you see there are some blades of grass coming through, through some dead grass, and that's normal. We're coming out of winter, so the grass blades have died back. And they form some people have called it a soil armor. So this armor or this covering does several things. Having this layer, it's doing several things. It's the future food. It's the food for your soil life. 
but it's also preventing the sun from drying the soil surface so it keeps your soil moist longer which will help little grass seeds germinate better because they stay moist and they need a little bit of shade to get started and then they'll come through they'll come through this bit of material no problem at all huh. wait the lawn care company said you have thatch you need to remove it well let's see what's the scenario if you spent your time dethatching it, then they'll say, well, you know what? Now your soil, your lawn needs to be fertilized because, you know, there isn't much food there, there isn't much nutrients there. And then they'll come in and mow it. Now that it's short, your lawn, there's some openings because you dethatch, it's not full enough. Maybe we should overseed it. And then they'll come in because you know what? Now that you've created openings while the grass seed has been sprouting, you probably have dandelions and other plants coming in and they'll say we need to put in a dose of herbicide to get rid of them in the meantime money is flowing from you to them whether for the services or if you're doing it yourself for the products that you would need to do that <sighs> where does it end just realize that this is not a problem it's an indicator of a deeper problem stop fertilizing you say if i stop fertilizing the grass won't grow it will have to take for organic it's called a transition it will have to transition by building up the soil life but you need to get life back into your soil so that it will look at this as a food and convert this food into the fertilizer for the grass naturally without you needing to intervene constantly so if you're on that tr treadmill of dethatch fertilize herbicide if you've even watched this far hey the choice is yours do you want to spend the rest of your life being a slave to your lawn or do you want to just enjoy it if you just enjoy it and let it cycle naturally the only thing you really need to do in a healthy lawn is mow and leave the clippings for the soil life. So that's my take on what the indicator is by having thatch. It's just indicating a lack of life in your soil. Get that life back and get your life back. Thanks for watching. Intrigued? Check out the virtual tour of the permaculture orchard. Have trees already? pruningcourse.com subscribe please check out some of the other videos or playlists there's more to come stay tuned bye hey you got one eh she ate it already i guess